Hey guys, how's it going? It's me, Richie Plunkett from the Poverty Geek and MMGN.com. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about how to keep track of your computers if they get stolen. So hey guys, so as you can see in the title of the bar, this is called the Prey Project. Now I've been using Prey for about a year and a half now or more, and I've been using it since it was in beta. And since then it's grown to become, you know, one of, I think, the best security softwares out there you could have on your computer, being a laptop, being a PC, being a Mac, being a desktop, whatever. I mean, you know, it's compatible with all platforms for Mac, Linux, Ubuntu. Um, Windows, everything you can name of. It's just a small script what runs in the background. I'll show you how to install it soon. Okay, so let's jump into the website and download Prey and I'll show you the process, what to do. Okay, so what you want to do is head over to preyproject.com and once you're there, just hit download now. It will automatically detect if you're running uh, Apple, Windows, uh, Linux, Ubuntu, or even Android even. So let's just set that to download. As you can see, it's about two megabytes, uh, it's not that big at all. But before I install this, let's go over the key features. Now, one of the two features I really like about Prey is the Wi-Fi Auto Connect and the Know Your Enemy, which uses your webcam. So let's talk about the Wi-Fi Auto Connect. Wi-Fi Auto Connect is, you know, if you enable it, it allows Prey in the background to attempt to try to hook up to Wi-Fi out there, you know, which is not protected by a password. And that allows, you know, your computer to send information to Prey, which can detect, you know, where your laptop or computer or whatever it is, you know, located. You know, for instance, you know, you'll find IP addresses, and that's when Know Your Enemy comes into place where, you know, if you have a webcam in your let's just say a laptop it was you know take pictures of even the user using it um so which is really great you know it's not that big it's not really intensive it's really lightweight it just sits in the background of your computer you don't even know it's running you just have to do it once and one of the other great features of prey is that it automatically updates itself without you even knowing um that's a really great thing because this is something to set and forget and you don't have to worry about it anymore so let's go into that. Let's just open that up. Um, now I'm installing this on a Apple computer. It will be exactly the same if you're running on a Windows, Linux, um, you know, Android, whatever. Just a different, you know, operating system. So let's agree to this. It'll run, and then you just got to hit the installer button. Let's go open. Yep. Yeah, I'll just do this again. Yeah, you just put in your password. Yep, and that's it. It's really simple. And the great thing about it is um, you can't uninstall it. Like if I was to go in here and type pray, you can't find it. It's not there. Like it's all the installers. And as you can see, I've done this a couple of takes. But it's not there. So saying that, you know, the only way to get rid of that software is to re-download it again and then run the uninstaller, which will get rid of the prey in the background. But let's jump into the website, which will connect your computer. So as you can see here, I'm using the free service, not the pro, because the free service you're limited to three devices, and the pro goes from you know ten devices to you know five hundred devices, or depending on what um, price package you've bought. So adding a new device is really easy. All you have to do is hit add new device, um, put in the information of your computer, that is your computer name. So saying that my one's called Snow White, you know I'll type Snow White as you can see here, and then name it as a desktop, a Mac, and then run it Snow Leopard or what whatnot. And then hit create. Now since I already have one, I'm not gonna hit create, but you know, you'll type in all your information there, hit create, and then it'll start sending information to your computer, which will then activate Prey through the control panel. So from here, it's basically just set and forget. I'll show you an image which Prey sent me because I did activate my iMac being missing just to you know make sure everything's all working when I first did that and here it is. So as you can see here Prey sent me all the information I need to track who stole my computer. Now as you can see here it's me. Uh, I didn't even know this was running, I didn't even see the webcam turning on. As you can see I'm concentrated on, don't know what I'm even looking at. You can zoom that in. Music. 
yeah that's what it is now you can see you can check the app time uh, the log user who they're logged in as and also all your IP addresses and MAC address and everything you need to get your um, you know hardware back so I really recommend Prey if you have a laptop and because most laptops now have webcams built in them and Prey you know takes pictures of those people and you know sends you IP addresses and everything and that will help you in the process of getting your laptop back and you know whatever hardware you had on there so guys so head over to Prey download it once that's all you have to do install it and then you're ready I mean if it does get stolen which you know hopefully it doesn't you can help the process go faster in finding and tracking you know your hardware down and as guys thanks for watching appreciate it a lot if you can like the video um, and I'll catch you in the next app review catch you guys later